What is going on everybody? It's Malulani aka MT Edits and we are here again with another video in my single player with a new vehicle showcase for you guys. Now this one may seem real familiar to you guys because it is, it's something I've done before but I've done a major upgrade to for those of you who have been rocking for a while and are in my Discord you guys should have recognized by now this is my 2017 M4 F92 with the high K Evo body kit. Let me say that again because I know it was a mouthful. This is my 2017 BMW M4 F92 with the high K Evo hardcore body kit. So you can see I already got it pretty much custom now. There's no extras or anything on it. Just going over um, what I did new to it, which is why I'm reposting this. We're not reposting because it's new. It's gonna be it's a whole whole separate thing. Um, but yeah, it is significantly different than the other um, M4 high K that I did in one major way. I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all right now. Let me go ahead and start it up. Well, not one major way, in a, in a few uh, different ways. So as y'all can see first, I know y'all probably wonder, oh, what's that little dent at the top? That is the first major upgrade I did to it. Because now, not only do I have a hard top, or not a hard top, not only do I have a non-convertible version, now I do have a convertible version. And all y'all probably think at the wing, Oh, won't it clip through the wing if I do that? No, it's not gonna clip. If y'all can see, I got some uh, some rods that are holding it and attaching it to the bumper just to make sure that it does not clip. So that way the spoiler can come off and back on. So let me go ahead and show you guys that. Yes, sir. Now as y'all see, the spoiler went ahead and it dropped back with the bumper, and it comes right back on and attaches itself. So y'all see what we got, man. We got the M4 fully convertible now this thing it just adds a whole nother level to it at the time of this posting it will be available on in my discord and in my tebex both of those links will be in the description down below another major thing that i changed is the handling i got this thing to handle much more like an m4 the first one i did to handle more like a drag type of car it was hard to turn off well, it was hard to turn um, based off your launch, it was hard to turn once you hit kind of top speed. I changed all of that, so it was realistic top speed, a realistic acceleration, realistic turning and sliding and all of that. So now as y'all can see, full throttle down, you can turn, you can slide and all of that with no effort. Yes, yeah, so now it doesn't just take off like a rocket where you're stuck going one direction. You have more mobility in a car, as you should in an M4. Yeah, those two things, they were basically the much um, the biggest upgrades. Oh, and I also changed the rims to the actual, actual stock BMW rims as well. If other than that, everything is pretty much the same. Let me go ahead and put that top on back on for you guys just so you can see. Again, this is more 5M friendly. There is no trim and dash colors and stuff like that. So that we have to use Benny's menu. It's all primary, secondary, and wheel color. The secondary is affecting everything that you see that is orange. The primary is affecting the body color itself. And actually, I don't think I assigned a wheel color to anything. So it's just the primary and secondary color. You got the high K tail lights. You know what I'm saying? Because that's pretty much it for this car. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do a little drive around showcase for you guys so you guys can see how it really handles how it's supposed to and all that man all of that so yeah if you guys do want to see this car in much more detail uh there will be a car that i pop up at the top right of your screen right about now and that will take you to the very first showcase of that bmw m4 high k um so you guys can go ahead and check that well 2017 i need to specify the 2017 bmw m4 high k I do have the 2021 BMW M4 High Kate under the way right now that I am making, so y'all make sure you stay tuned for that. Yeah, other than that, let's go ahead and let's get that drive going again. If you want to see this car in greater detail, go ahead and click that first link where I showcase the entire car. Because this one, I'm just showcasing the new features that I did with it. So let me go ahead and let's hit this stream going the complete wrong way.
turn it around and as usual put this into the night time you guys can see what it looks like at night Another quick look around. Not expecting that bump there. God dang. But like y'all just said, I aim to make this handle as much as real life as possible because I, I wish I would see someone going 90 and hit a random bump like that and not see their car go flying. It's gonna be pop daytime because I do have some collisions, some really nice collisions on here. Smash my whole car. In. God dang. Fix that because that is going to be it for this video. Real short and simple because of, I don't want to say short and simple. Um, what's it called? Modeling I did here because it was far, far from me. But it wasn't too many changes, so let me drop the top again. BMW M4 High Cade Evo Hardcore Kit. Y'all see it here, man. Y'all see it here. So, again, if you guys are interested in getting this car, go ahead and join my Discord. Link will be in the description, or you can go get it through my website on Tebex. The link in this is in the description for that as well for y'all to go ahead and check out yourselves. So, do let me know what y'all think in the comments down below or in my Discord again. I don't know what I'm about to say. Link is in the description. So I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Let me know if y'all do. Go ahead and give it a like if y'all did. Go ahead and uh, comment what y'all like. Comment what car you think I should do next. And subscribe to the channel so you guys can stay up to date on everything I'm doing car-wise, video-wise. And I promise, man, I'm getting more 5M videos for you guys to go ahead and watch. It's been real busy, really, real, real busy. So I haven't been able to, to hop in 5M and really roleplay like that with the boys. But that is coming, so make sure y'all stay tuned for that. Those videos, they are coming real soon. So again, I appreciate you guys' support. I appreciate you guys for watching. Without further ado, I'm out.